Welcome to our topic today. Uh, we'll be talking about medical card versus critical illness. So just a brief info about myself. My name is Keith and I have experience in working in the financial line for since 2015. And below I actually some of the things that I do for my clients. So today I wanted to, uh, to gather some questions from my clients where I encountered that they told me I have medical card already. Why need critical illness? Isn't critical illness and medical card benefit the same? I thought medical card already covers for critical illness. So just to give some uh, questions regards to medical card. Today, medical card serves as a hospitalization benefit where it mainly covers for your hospitalization fee incurred with the hospital or the clinic. So it's subdivided into a pre-hospitalization whereby today you get to claim from your medical card if you, uh, before you admit to the hospital, maybe you have done some check with the clinic uh, and subsequently you are referred to the hospital for further checkup and resulted in a hospitalization. This is where you can claim from your medical card. Next is actually on post hospitalization where you can actually follow up with your hospital, with your doctor for any changes in your bandages, follow up with your treatments uh, and to make sure that you are recovering correctly. Next uh, is covered by the medical card is your inpatient like your surgeries, your operating theatres, your physician visits. These are covered under the hospitalization benefit. Lastly is on the coverage of outpatient where sometimes you uh, sub, uh, succumb to any kidney failure where you need to do a kidney dialysis, you can do so or you can even opt for cancer treatment. Uh, you may even opt for an outpatient dengue treatment and even for accidents like Maybe you accidentally fall down on the staircase and you injured yourself, you can actually do so without having to be hospitalized and to be warded and etc. Next, we will actually look into critical illness. A critical illness is a payout in the event of a critical illness. For example, maybe you had kidney failure, you have a heart attack and etc. So it serves as an income protection as a person may not be able to work for a period of time after being diagnosed with a critical illness. And it's definitely not the same as a medical card benefit and it's normally an add-on rider within a policy. So which means someone who can be hospitalized, let's say they succumb to a stroke, subsequently in the hospital, they, uh, the doctor decided to say that you are ready to be discharged but due to stroke you may be paralyzed for a period of time either semi-permanently or permanently this is where the payout from the critical illness actually helps to lessen your financial burden while you are recovering from your illness so this is the difference between a medical card and a critical illness uh, benefit itself so hope that uh, this video actually uh, give you a clearer idea of you know, uh, what's the difference and don't get confused by these two riders itself. All right. So I thank you again for your time, for listening. Uh, if you do have a, a question, um, then I will be able to create another video to answer it for you. And feel free to give some feedback and input as well. So I'll see you in the next question. So remember to click the bell button for not notification. Uh, Click the like button and also to share this post. See you.